troubled with 100% CPU usage constantly? In this video, you will see fixes for high CPU usage on your PC instantly. Heavy CPU usage is not usually due to one reason. There are several reasons your CPU usage could shoot up to 100%. We will go to them one by one. So follow the instructions from the beginning and keep doing them until your issue is resolved. Once you have followed all the steps, not only will your PC's CPU usage be reduced, but it will also improve the performance. Disable startup apps. Startup apps start running when you start your computer and keep running in the background, consuming system resources. Let's disable unnecessary startup apps. Right-click on the taskbar and select Task Manager. Go to the Startup Apps tab. Here, click on the Status tab to sort it. Now, carefully observe each app and disable the one that you don't need to run with your system. Right-click on them and select Disable. Disable background apps. Several apps run in the background that you don't use. Let's disable them. Open Settings, go to the Apps, and select Installed Apps. You will have to disable the background running permission for each app one by one. In Windows 10, they used to have a separate section from where you could find and disable all background apps, but not in Windows 11. Click on this three-dot menu. If you see the Advanced option here, which means the app can run in the background, click on it. Then, under Background App Permissions, select Never. You can do this to all apps that don't need to run all the time. Disable Load Startup Items. The next thing we will do is disable all the items that run with your system. It will drastically reduce the CPU usage. Press Windows plus R and type msconfig and hit Enter. You will see the System Configuration window. On the General tab, click on Selective Startup. Then deselect the box of Load Startup Items. Click Apply. Disable unnecessary third-party services. On the same System Configuration window, go to the Services tab. Click on the Hide All Microsoft Services. Now, here, the services you are seeing are only third-party services. Click on Disable All. Then manually enable the essential services such as AMD slash Intel, NVIDIA, Realtek, and other driver services. Now click Apply and OK. Now restart your computer and you will see reduced CPU usage. Configure Delivery Optimization Settings. Delivery Optimization downloads updates for you and acts as a server to update other PCs in your network. You can stop it to save more system resources. Click on the Start menu and Open Settings. Go to Windows Update. Click on Advanced Options. Here, go to Delivery Optimization. You will see Allow Downloads from Other Devices. Use the toggle button to turn it off. Configure Core Isolation. If you are severely low on CPU, you can disable the core isolation to boost performance. This feature uses your CPU to stop malware attacks. Click on the Start menu, search for Windows Security, then open it. Go to the Device Security tab. Click on Core Isolation Details. Now, disable the memory integrity. Disable unrequired services. Now we are going to disable some unrequired services that keep running in the background and keep consuming your CPU. Click on the Start menu and search for Services. Open it. Now look for the Background Intelligent Transfer Service. Right-click on it, select Properties, stop the service, then choose Disabled from the Startup Type. Click Apply and OK. Next service to disable is SysMain. Right-click Properties, stop the service, select Disabled. Click Apply then look for Windows Search. Do the same with this. Stop the service and choose Disabled in the startup type. Then find the Windows Error Reporting Service. Disable it also. Next, look for Connected User Experiences and Telemetry. Right-click and select Properties. Stop the service. Choose Disabled in the startup type. Click Apply and OK. After disabling these five services, your PC will have some more system resources. Turn off Windows visual effects. Visual effects and animations look cool, but at the same time, they use your CPU. Let's disable them. Click on the Start menu, search for Adjust the Appearance and Performance of Windows. Open it. Click on the Advanced tab and make sure Adjust for Best Performance of Programs is selected, then go back to the Visual Effects tab. 
Here, select Adjust for Best Performance. It will disable all the visual effects on your PC. However, you can turn on some essential ones so that your PC doesn't look dull. Enable Peak, show thumbnails instead of icons, show window contents while dragging, and smooth edges of screen fonts. Enable these, click Apply, and OK. Activate Ultimate Performance Power Plan. Your PC's power plan actively decides the performance, so let's configure it. Click on the Start menu and type Control Panel. Open it. Click here to change the default view to large icons. Then click on the Power Plans. Here you will see some power plans like Balanced, High Performance, and Power Saver. But the ultimate performance power plan that we are looking for is not here. We need to activate it. To do that, click on the Start menu and type PowerShell, right-click on it, and select Run as Administrator. Click on the Yes in the UAC pop-up. Now copy the code from the video description and paste it into the PowerShell window. Hit the Enter button, go one step back in the Power Plan, and open it again to refresh it, and you will see the Ultimate Performance Power Plan. Activate it. Let's configure it a little more. Click on the Change Plan settings beside it. Then, on this screen, click on Change Advanced Power Settings. In here, scroll down and expand Processor Power Management. In the maximum processor state, I would suggest you set it between 80% to 100% to encounter the high CPU usage. You can experiment here to see at which state your computer performs better. Then set the minimum processor state between 5 to 15%. This way, you can enjoy the best performance with the lowest CPU usage. I hope that after following all these steps, your 100% CPU usage is fixed. In case you face any issues, don't forget to comment it down. If the video has helped you, don't forget to hit the like button and share it with your friends. Do subscribe to the channel and hit the bell button to receive alerts of videos on Windows tips and tricks.